Hello everyone, welcome back to Technit. This is Sanit. Please do subscribe, like, hit the bell icon for more updates. So sorry for the delay. Check your registered Infosys Springboard account for any shortlisted or virtual internship section. Check your inbox or spam folder for email, communications, title like Infosys Springboard internship, 6.4 results or similar. So log into the Springboard platform to see your status dashboard. Documents or UA may include your status. Reach out to support via Springboard help section if you have completed modules but have not received any email yet. So after that, uh, you have to do check your email and Springboard dashboard. After that, you have to go to the website and you have to verify your documents like PAN card and other card. So there are allocated batches and onboarding session will be completed within the one, one month itself. So if you have batch one or two, it will be uh, applied. If you have batch six or seven, it, it may take some delay to after the completion of batch one, they go to batch two. So this is the process. You'll be assigned to batch can't be changed. So once your batch is assigned, you can't be changed. So you may get an onboarding module or short video orientation. So first two weeks, project intro plus research problem understanding. Next three to four weeks, phase one project implementation. Five to six weeks, finalizes implementation documentation. Seven to eight week project submission. So this is a four milestones over eight weeks. So final submission, submit your project before the deadline, includes code files, screenshots, report PDF for document. So certificate students, if you complete all milestones and submitted the final project, you will receive an Infosys internship completion certificate, so PDF downloadable. Okay. So this is a important reminder sir, no live mentorship, reach out support if you any models start, do not unlock or if submission issues arise. Okay. And one thing before that you have to verify your documents through the online virtual meeting so document needed are mainly important two one is your id card mandatory one is another government id either government other card a pan card voter id passport etc so this will be very crucial role while you are entering to the uh, internship so don't do any mistakes in that if you do any mistakes you can you lost your internship so be careful and attention and also mindful. So I talked to a person before who done springboard internship. So this is a major concerns they faced while doing internship. Please subscribe Tata. Bye bye. Comment down for any. Please comment down for any problems issues. I will really solve.